Welcome to reallylearnguitar.com and here's another Jeff's tip of the week. Today we're going to talk about something very simple. It's a finger strengthening exercise and the basic concept of it is to just switch back and forth between two fingers as rapidly and as hard as you possibly can for the longest amount of time that you can do it without injuring yourself. Um, what you should feel ultimately is a little burn. Uh, you know what they say, no pain, no gain. Uh, I suggest for a, a beginner to start at maybe about 30 seconds and the drill is basically pick a note somewhere on your guitar. So in the case of, of what I'm going to do here, I'm going to take the 5th fret on the 3rd string and I'm going to use my 3rd finger and I'm simply going to hammer on, which is to punch the string with your finger, and pull off, which is to pluck the string with your finger. So it's a punch, pluck, punch, pluck hammer pull hammer pull and you just want to really try to go for good volume and try to go as hard as you can and remember to breathe while you do this because uh, sometimes I've seen people stop and another thing to think about is to go at a pace that's hard for you but not so hard that you can't last the full time amount uh, so like I said I might do this for 30 seconds and you want to be able to last the whole time while going at a good rate. Uh, simply put, then, you just do different finger groups. Maybe I'll use my first and second finger. My fourth finger. Maybe I'll do different combinations. My second and third finger. My pinky. And in a nutshell, that's what it's about. Uh, you'll find that if you do this on a regular basis, um, by regular I mean daily or every other day, uh, that your finger strength will increase dramatically in a really short amount of time. Um, it's also important after you do this exercise, um, two things, a couple things that I like to do. Uh, number one is to be sure that I play before I do this. I don't like to come into it cold because then you might pull muscles or have sore, sore muscles. And then after I've done it, I'll, I'll massage my hand, massage my arm, wherever it starts to feel sore. A lot of people feel it right in the palm of the hand or in the muscle in between your thumb and first finger. And then I also like to do some stretches, just lightly pull my fingers back and then lightly pull my fingers forward. And then just some wrist spins and loosen up your shoulders and all kinds of things like that. So. If you, you apply yourself to this a little bit, you'll find that your fingers will get strung really quick, and uh, that's a good thing. So until then, work hard, and I will see you next time.